so today we have packed up the team of Fenwell Warriors and we've come to Ipakaria in Waimahia um, and we've just built this whānau here, a garden through our Project Southside 600 garden. And we took eight wheelbarrows of mulch and soil, made up a garden box as well, placed it in a place that gets a lot of sun and water and then when we were planting we managed to put in about 24 to 36 seedlings which means that we are able to feed multiple types of kai to this whānau as well. Had a bit of a warning around the garden box as well. Uh, what this allows us to do is give the information that this particular whānau needs to know. We talked about composting, we talked about how it is that they can protect their kai from different insects and pests and diseases. Um, but also we, we allowed a space where we were able to connect the whānau to the garden box instead of just having a box of soil. I missed out. <laughs> I find that harder than the actual dirt doing. Yeah. <laughs> the actual walking dirt, Karen. Yeah. It's hard, yo. Get it, Karen. <laughs> Um, so when you companion plant them like that, um, they, they both look after each other, they both feed each other, oh, they yeah. both give nutrients to each other. Um, and what you'll need to do as well is stack them up eventually. Yeah. They will need a water a pretty water. soon, um, but where your garden is positioned, you probably want to wait until... Yeah, about 5 o'clock would be good. When you cut off what you need, it can yep. keep growing. Oh, so it's, it's one of those plants that grow really quickly, really easily, and don't need much maintenance. It's all water. Um, do you eat silver beet or yeah, we do it. flower? Yeah, uh, Silver beet. Eh? Silver beet, cool, okay. Cool. Chuck it in with the boiler. Yep, yeah. perfect. Yeah, that's the <laughs> one. some hints and tips and stuff here as well, just so that it's all written down and I'm not just blabbing out like 50 million things in your game. Oh, okay lady. Uh, calm down lady. So Kelly, how did the team do? Oh, they were right I suppose. <laughs> 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 um, no, our team is epic. Um, it's always a great day when we get to work together. It's always a great day when uh, we have other whānau coming in and joining us as well. What it allows us to do is just train up community champions to become whenua warriors and be able to manage this type of a role themselves as well. I feel like the whole entire idea of whenua warrior is to be able to empower the person to continue the mata. And if we can do that within our team, we can do it within the community. Where are we off to next, Kels? <laughs> We are off to Waddle Downs to do another garden ball. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs>